when I got to high school, it was Overbrook High School, which is not famous for me being there, but it is for Will Chamberlain, who was the uh, great basketball star, but he he was at Overbrook. He actually was a freshman when I was a senior, and I, I got to meet him once. Uh, but that school was very unique at its time because it was a it was a magnet school, not for intelligence, but for backgrounds because the neighborhoods that encompassed uh, were black, Italian, Jewish. Jewish kids came from Winfield across the bridge to Overbrook, and we represented about 50 percent of the uh, of the enrollment in the school, which was pretty big. Uh, my class, there were A and B classes, so about 800 kids, 900 kids a year graduated. He said 1,000 were almost 4,000 kids, 2,000 of which would have been Jewish. Uh, 25 percent were black, and the rest were either Catholic, uh, Protestant, Italian, whatever. Uh, so it was a real mix, and it, I learned at a very early age to learn to get along with these people. There was, there were no gang wars. Nobody carried guns in the school. No cops roamed the hallways. About the most trouble you'd get into would be caught smoking somewhere, and it was not allowed, or, or uh, leaving the uh, the building to go get lunch across the street when you weren't allowed to leave the the building. Uh, but we learned that there were people who were different. And uh, it was a unique situation. There's another thing that I learned, and it, <laughs> I, I think it's kind of a chauvinistic attitude, but I had always thought that the Jews, the Jewish kids I knew, were the smartest and the brightest of the class. And, and certainly in elementary and in junior high, uh, that was probably the case. Uh, there were not a lot of non-Jewish kids, but in high school it was a different story. And I learned real quickly there were a lot of non-Jewish kids who were a hell of a lot brighter than us Jewish kids and who didn't study as hard or whatever. But uh, there was a lesson to be learned there. And it was, uh, it was a coming-of-age thing to recognize that uh, the, 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 some of the greatest minds in the world were not Jewish. True, most of the Nobel, many Nobel laureates were Jewish and there is a high percentage of Jewish achievers intellectually. But... Uh, I, I had to learn the hard way that uh, the Jews were not the smartest people in the room all the time.